<laughs> so today we took a digital impression on Kim, and you saw it in the process. As a clinician, what I like about the digital scan certainly is the accuracy, the ability to see my prep instantly. Also, this is sent to the laboratory, and literally they could be trimming the dye the same afternoon that I actually prepped the tooth within an hour. And so that's a huge advantage in getting cases back sooner. Also, for my patients for comfort, and we'll talk to Kim about this, is the ability to do a little bit of an impression, take a break, do a little bit more. If I miss an area, I can go back and capture it versus taking a traditional analog or polyvinyl impression and then taking it out and realize that we screwed up and we got to basically start all over and wait the four to five minutes, however long the impression takes to set up. So it's great for patients, pedo patients, that just can't stay open long enough. Some of our elderly where maybe want to take just a little bit of the impression at a time. You know, the typical impression on Kim, since we're replacing a canine, we went on the left side, we went all the way back to the molar, and I came to the second premolar on the right side so that the lab can now duplicate the shape of the contralateral tooth and we get a great mounting. Also, the computer will tell us if we have a good mounting and we see that instantly instead of the laboratory calling and saying, listen, we can't mount this case. Again, we've all encountered that and that's a huge problem. So there's lots of advantages and the typical scan will take me anywhere between a minute and a half, maybe two minutes on, on some of our patients where I take a little bit of a break. So it's quick and the more you do it, the quicker you'll be at it. In my practice, and here at Keating Dental Arch, I chose the TrueDef from 3M. I like the size of the wand itself. It's the thinnest on the market. Also, this is the most affordable camera on the market. Now, it doesn't mean that you're limited just to the TrueDef. <clears throat> Some of you may be looking at Iteros or already own one, or have a Serac or a Plan Scan or a Trios or a CareStream. Those are all other examples of digital scanners. We at Keating Dental Arch accept all those. So whether it's done with the TrueDef or any of the other digital impression taking machines or scanners, we can accept those as a digital file. We can either make models or not, depending on what, what your preferences are. So that's my taking on this, all this technology. So let's talk to the patient. You know, you've, you've obviously had some crown and bridge yes. before, so you've had lots of impressions taken. Right. So what was your feeling about having a digital impression versus a traditional impression? It was uh, much easier. It was uh, not as traumatic on me uh, having to have the putty put in my mouth and wait for it to harden up before you can take the impression out. So that's very uncomfortable. The scan was fast. It was easy. It wasn't uncomfortable at all. Okay. Um, I, th I thought it was a 100% improvement. Yeah, and, and also you're a techno guy. So, I mean, the technology certainly makes you feel better about that. I'm keeping up with what, what technology is offering us as clinicians, and we're doing the very best well, we can. Well, absolutely. I, I think that it all begins to come together with, with the technical expertise that you have, the dental laboratory that you use, and the materials that you're using today to yeah. really give us a nice smile that's going to last, last the rest of our life. Yeah, absolutely. We hope so. <laughs> yes. Until you break another one, right? <laughs> True. Um, so I want to talk to you a little bit about the powder because, you know, that's something that's come up with a lot of different manufacturers. And, you know, we powdered it for both arches as well as the bite. Right. Was that uncomfortable for you? Was that a negative for you? Not at all. Not yeah. at all. In fact, I, I, couldn't even, I couldn't even tell it was there. Yeah. And, 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 and again, this is why I don't think the powder is a real problem. Again, the older powders from the older machines were. But, I mean, this is just since battery operated, it's just such a light, almost like a silicone, that it, it's not uncomfortable. And for those that are using some of the other machines that don't require powder, and sometimes you get uh, some standard deviation in your scans, you may look at some of the powdering systems, just especially if you have pre-existing ceramic crowns. So we're going to go ahead and move forward, and we're going to run this case through the laboratory. You'll have the opportunity to see that and what Keating Dental Arch does with this digital scan, and then we'll see the crown on Kim. Thanks for being such a great patient. Thank you, Dr. Holmbrook. Great. great.